how was the browse popping with cracking it today lots of reacts to these p diddy memes i knew they were coming i knew they were coming um so yeah we're gonna see what people are saying hopefully nothing crazy happens to him because people have been making comments and saying like oh they're gonna try to get him in jail you know, it's the same thing happened with Jeffrey Epstein. And, you know, they killed him in jail, tried to make it seem like he killed himself. So, you know, people are talking. So who knows what's going to take place. But hopefully he he's okay in, in that area. And he just rots in jail. He serves his time in jail. But, you know, I wouldn't wish death on anybody. Um, but anyway, we're going to see what, what these memes are. Let's watch. Diddy's house be like... <laughs> Like, how do you have a thousand bottles of lube and baby oil? <laughs> That's how a bottle could work. <laughs> Don't bring Squidward in this. He would they never. They say Diddy had his own handcuffs ready with a best boy. <laughs> <laughs> cheetah print at that. <laughs> Not cheetah print. Sean Combs is the best boy. That's what you got to do. Crazy. That sounds so <laughs> That man is no longer on the prowl. <laughs> Can we just call him Diddler? I hope Kesha didn't wake up feeling like he did it this morning. <laughs> oh, she changed the lyrics. She didn't clarify what she meant by this. <laughs> right, why does she ever even say that? Cardi B. <laughs> All right. <laughs> All right. I don't know. Little Diddy, boy, bye. <laughs> Diddy 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 this ashy ass laugh, Mitch. Lock the sun that looks like Diddy up too, just in case. <laughs> I saw people saying that. Yeah, y'all better keep an eye out on Little Diddy Jr. <laughs> Johnson and Johnson during That's Diddy messed up because, yeah, people who are related to him are going to be criticized and judged just by association and that's not right because obviously everybody wasn't on the same time as him just because they're his kids that don't mean they're guilty too you know but they were in handcuffs when when the feds raided his house but maybe that was just protocol to put everybody in handcuffs because when anyway <laughs> i anyway <laughs> keep putting my business to myself they just lost the biggest customer <laughs> Even Biggie knew to keep an eye on Diddy at all times. <laughs> so rude. And I thought he was just cockeyed. <laughs> you know what? This is unnecessary. Our Diddy, the internet never makes other things. Yeah, that's why. Why kind of look like Scooby Doo if he was a human? <laughs> <laughs> In that drawing, he looked a lot like Can our Can you survive? Five nights at Diddy. <laughs> this is scary. I don't know. Give me a blue Gatorade. I'll give it a shot. <laughs> We know. We know, Mitch. <laughs> if the glove don't fit. Hey, he's, you know what? He's, he's being more and more honest <laughs> as time goes on and he releases more and more of these videos. And I had my suspicions, but, you know, I don't want to put anything on anybody, but he's become very open and it's just like, okay, now I understand some of these jokes. 
especially the the vagina jokes. It's like it, it's all making sense, which is unfortunate because I feel like whatever. That's a whole other conversation. <laughs> but that irritates me. That that annoys me with with some whatever. <laughs> because there are so many victims, you know? And even when he said, like, oh, they're going to have PTSD when they smell baby oil, it's like, I'm sure a lot of them already have PTSD, you know? Like, everything that they that they endured. And I saw that somebody is trying to do a documentary. I forgot who they said was doing one, but apparently they're already, like, lining up victims they're lining up people to talk to who have had bad experiences with Diddy and they want to, you know, share their stories. So, yeah, this is about to get crazy. This is even worse than the, the R. Kelly situation, I would argue. Because there were definitely claims that he was messing with underage girls and we don't have any solid proof yet, but I feel like that's going to for sure come out. So, yeah, this is wild. Y'all let me know what y'all think, though. Let me know what other videos you're going to watch and I'll see y'all in the next one. Bye!